She was my dad's first cousin through the McNeils, and she was my mother's second cousin through the Montgomerys. So I'm doubly related to her. <laughs> we always had a lot of pictures of Aunt Maud, but that was always the family's favorite picture. It just seemed to be Aunt Maud. I had heard rumors when I was, I was young. I had heard rumors that this was the case, but we all thought so much of her that we, uh, we, we wanted to forget about it <laughs> because we all saw the, the humor side of Aunt Maud. She was comical, she was jolly, and we just loved to see her come to visit my old home in Park Corner, where she was married. This is my mother. She and, and Lucy Maud were great friends. They corresponded all the time. That was my mother. That's your mother, Ella, right there. That's my mother. And my mother and her used to be sitting talking and reminiscing over old courtships and they'd laugh, their cotton-picking heads off. <laughs> so my memories were very happy, and I, we just never saw. If she was sad, she kept it to herself, and she had a lot of things to be sad about during her lifetime, I understand. They'd come to the door, and I remember they'd say, is Ella Montgomery here? And my mother would say, yes. Is it possible that we could talk to her? And, of course, my mother was always kind to everybody, and she'd say, oh, yes, come right in. And mother would invite them in, and they would talk to Aunt Maud, which we always called her. She wanted us to call her Aunt Maud. Mm. And uh, she would talk to them, answer any questions that they wanted to answer. That's a picture of... Ella Montgomery's son, Dr. Stuart McDonald. And that's taken in front of my old home in Kensington. And that's you in the picture there? That's me.